It's Umsum time. Huh? <laughs> oh. Why don't cockroaches die easily? Mm? Cause they have Iron Man's armor. No. Mm? Cockroaches are highly <laughs> resilient creatures. They even survived the mass extinction that wiped out <gasps> dinosaurs. Wow, that's impressive. Cockroaches don't die easily because they have a strong, flexible exoskeleton. It helps them withstand weights oh. which are up to 300 to 900 times their own body weight. <laughs> In addition to this, cockroaches can live without food for a month and a week without water. Huh? Yes. Cockroaches can even hold their breath for around 20 minutes in water and can survive without a head for a week. <laughs> oh, stop bluffing. Without a head, they won't be able to breathe. No. Nah. They have tiny holes on their bodies which help them breathe, thus preventing oh. them from dying instantly. Nah. What is arthritis? It is a chemical formed by mixing hydrochloric acid and sulfuric acid. Oh, dude. From where do you get such ideas? To explain arthritis, we need to first understand what a joint is. A joint is a place where two bones meet. When there is inflammation, swelling, or pain in one or more joints, then it is termed as arthritis. The cause of arthritis depends upon the type of arthritis. Hmm. Rheumatoid arthritis is an autoimmune disorder. In this disorder, our immune cells mistakenly start attacking the tissue surrounding a joint and thus damage it. This leads to inflammation, swelling, and pain in the joint. Osteoarthritis occurs when the cartilage that cushions the ends of bones in a joint gradually breaks down and wears away. As a result, the bones begin to rub against each other, causing swelling and pain in that joint. Hmm. Why is space black? Because somebody forgot to pay the electricity bill. <laughs> nah. Our sun is a huge star, which emits a tremendous amount of light. However, like our sun, there are so many stars in the universe that counting them is almost impossible. So, if there are so many stars, the space shouldn't be black or dark, right? Absolutely! However, this is not the case. According to a study, this space appears black because the universe is expanding. This expansion is causing the visible light emitted by the stars to stretch out so much that when it reaches our eyes, they cannot detect it. As our eyes cannot detect any visible light, the space appears black to us. Moreover, light has a specific speed limit. So, light from far, far away stars has not even reached us. Thus, the space appears huh? black. Hmm. How do snowflakes form? My snowman makes them. You wish. <laughs> a snowflake begins to form when a supercooled water droplet in the sky freezes onto a dust particle or pollen forming a tiny ice crystal. However, when water freezes, its molecules arrange themselves in a hexagonal pattern, thus giving the crystal a hexagonal shape. Hmm. Now, as the ice crystal keeps falling, it comes in contact with more water. As a result, the water starts freezing on the six corners of the ice crystal, causing branches to grow on the corners and thus giving us a beautiful snowflake. Also, as the atmosphere conditions are the same on all sides of the snowflake, the branches grow identically, thus ah. making the snowflake symmetrical. But since every snowflake follows a different pattern to the ground, it encounters different atmosphere conditions. Hence, it is said that no two snowflakes are the same. They all tend to be unique. 